Okay, I'm back out here at the ghost town. Twelve forty-four, thirteen forty-four. First really good signal. Showing up pretty shallow though, we'll see what happens. It was a brass ring. <laughs> That's part of hunting in these ghost towns. Okay. Just dug about a three inch hole here and uh, pulled up this neat little brooch or I don't know if it's a hair piece or what that's to but some kind of decorative piece of brass or something like that anyway pretty neat okay got a 1242 it wasn't an inch I just scratched it up with my foot I'm not sure if that's my first watch fob it's got this little slot up here at the top kind of makes me think that's what that might be sorry yeah I think I have my first watch fob here I'll get it cleaned up later and see if it says anything that's kind of what that looks like that would be cool all right thanks guys just had a 1241 8 inch coil now uh, about 3 inches deep found my first Oklahoma tax token of the day I haven't found very many of these actually but uh, this is the for old age assistance Oklahoma tax token cool guys I'm right here real close to the water Trying to see if I can see the date. Anyway, cool. First coin. I'll see if I can clean it up. All right, we've been here about six hours now. I finally got about a. It's like a 841. It was a weird number down in this hole, but it was pretty shallow. And this is just my second coin of the day. I don't know if you can see it right there. It's a barber or better. <laughs> wow. Let me see if I can get it to focus a little better. Go stick it in the lake, Peter. I guess I better go put it in the lake real quick. Alright, I'll be back. Okay, we've we've had our little freak out. And uh Oh come on, show up. 1850 three seated dime my first ever seated I'm freaking out right now I mean it's pretty worn but uh, here with my good luck charm Rob move the camera all right yeah it's like a 841 kind of a weird number and it was not really that deep but there it is I'm not gonna clean it up anymore holy cow we go rob a live dig. Got something down in there. Pretty deep. Uh oh. There's, it's 
stumping. All right, well, he found it. Gigantic ring of some kind. <laughs> yeah, about uh, okay. 890. Hey guys, I didn't get to do a wrap up at the end of the hunt, so I thought I'd go ahead and uh, just show you what I found. A couple uh, strange what's it's. I don't really know what this thing is, but uh, part moves inside it. I found this, it's kind of cool, looks like a, oh, it looks kind of like a key, it's pretty heavy, it's made out of brass, it's got like a serial number, 3215, something like that, if you guys know what this is, uh, let me know, I'm not sure what that is, it's kind of like a bell to me, there's no hole in the top of it though, so I'm really not sure what that is. This is kind of a cool little piece of brass. Uh, I guess it's a piece of jewelry. It's got this little bent up clasp on the back. But uh, it's kind of cool. Always find one or two pieces like that. Not a buckle. And, you know, just another button of some kind. Always find a button. This was one of about five. I just was the one I happened to pull out. This was pretty cool. I don't know if that's a watch fob, if that's a metal, you know, obviously that's the Masonic symbol there. But I thought that was pretty neat. Uh, there's nothing on the back of it. It's just smooth, but uh, it's either a metal or a watch fob. It's kind of like, I thought at first it was maybe a coin. Uh, you can see how it's raised there. It looks like a coin. But it's got the, uh, the Mason symbol on it. That was just basically lay, laying right on top of the ground uh, maybe barely a half inch down maybe I just rubbed the dirt off with my foot and found that one and then uh, just an, I cannot get a date off this wheat penny it's the first coin I found of the day uh, it's just super smooth and corroded uh, I don't find a lot of these so I thought this was pretty cool tax token uh, this is the consumer tax token. Uh, so it's like for old age assistance. You know, I know a lot of you guys find a lot of these, but uh, that was kind of neat. And then my best find and something that I have never found and really didn't think I would find in Oklahoma. That's an 1853 seated dime. Amazing. I thought when I first pulled it up, it was, as you saw earlier in the video, all I saw was the back. So I thought I had another barber. Same place I found the barber last weekend. Uh, just and really not even that far from where I found the barber. But anyway, uh, no mint mark. It's uh, my best find ever. <laughs> so anyway, really happy about that. Uh, you know, not the best shape. The coins, the silver down there, it seems like it's always dirty. You know, it's pretty much every one I've seen has come out with this corrosion or tarnish. I don't know what it is, but uh, that's just kind of how they look. And I'm not going to clean this one up. I cleaned up that barber. It wasn't worth anything, but uh, I'm going to leave this one how it is. Anyway, thanks for watching. This was pretty fun, so maybe we'll do it again. See ya.